back. 15 acres of land that's sitting empty right now at the corner of 183 and Scottsdale Drive in Cedar Park will soon transform into a giant sports complex. Developers unveiled a plan today saying that the project whose main tenant would be Chaparral Ice. KXAN's Eugene Cho found out why developers are confident that there's a big enough demand for a big ice rink to expand. A $15 billion market. That's how big youth sports are, according to Wintergreen Research. To give you some context, the National Football League is a $14 billion industry. Here in Central Texas. I mean, we're at the rink seven days a week. The owner of Chaparral Ice told us hockey is getting more popular. Last year we saw about 70,000 unique individuals come through this building. Chaparral Ice will add two more rinks at the new Cedar Park Sports Complex. Developers told us it's a much needed expansion. Austin, as an example, is about two million people, I guess, in the metro area, and we have one full sheet of ice at, at Chaparral. Dallas, as an example, is six million people, and they're going on their 28th sheet of ice. And we operate at about 140 percent capacity at all times. The complex will have turf fields and other sports-related doctor's offices and stores as well. There'll be a gym there for the parents to work out. There'll be, you know, family entertainment restaurant where the families can go. There'll be other sports that the kids can play. The hope is the youth sports economy will continue to grow. Everyone ends up here and they end up part of uh, uh, a group that's tight knit. Uh, you know each other, you see each other all the time, so the kids are safe, the families are safe. Eugene Cho, KXAN News. They hope to break ground by this fall and open for the fall season in 20. 19. Cedar Park is just the latest city working to add a sports complex. Back in May of last year, a multi-million dollar sports complex opened up in Round Rock. That complex sits on 60 acres at Old Settlers Park. And in Pflugerville, construction is underway on a new $61 million park and sports complex. The 1849 project was approved by voters back in 2014. The more than 300 acre area is expected to have practice fields for lacrosse, rugby, soccer and football. A master plan for the park though is still in the works. And just earlier this week we learned that Buda is looking to get an indoor sports complex. In all, the project will be around 600,000 square feet and include a sports retail center. The complex will mostly focus on indoor volleyball.